find tan 1560 to find this we should follow this method c here we have 1560 now we should check 1560 lies between which two multiples of 180 what i mean is 1560 lies between 1440 and 1620 this is 180 into 8 and this is 180 into 9 between these two numbers 1560 lies next 1560 is close to which number this is close to 1620 so in place of this now we should write 1620 minus 60 so this will become tan in place of this we should write this 1620 minus 60 this is your step 1 next tan in place of this now we should write 9 into 180 minus 60 next here we have 180 so tan is not going to change it will remain tan and inside we get this angle 60 now the question is will we get here plus or minus to answer that we should look at the number before 180 that is 9 and 9 is odd and all the odd multiples of 180 they lie in either in the second or in the third quadrant so now to select the quadrant we should look at this symbol here we have negative that means angle lies in the second quadrant and in the second quadrant tan is negative so we should put negative so negative tan 60 is root 3 this is our answer